Welcome back to Honey Badger 3D Print and Paint. Today we're going to be looking at the uh, Johnny Cobra Kai model. But before we do that, roll those credits. Right, now this is the uh, Johnny model from the uh, Cobra Kai series, um, I believe this was from CG Trader. Um, so, about the model, the model prints in two pieces, I say two pieces, it's not really two pieces, the whole model is one piece and this little piece of bandana is a second piece. Um, so, let's just call it one piece. Um, now, the model, I really like it, so before we go into it any deeper, let's have a closer look at it. Right, now as I say, um, printed really well, maybe a couple of few too many layer lines visible on the face for me with this print. Um, we've since switched our printer profiles from Simplify 3D to Cure um, and we have, we have noticed a remarkable difference with the print quality. Um, Feels a little bit annoying, but wasted that much time on Simplify. Um, just the tree support setting alone on Cure, it's, it's worth it. Um, right now, the actual print itself. So, I really like this. Mm, done this for my wife, really. She really loves the series. Um, I'm happy with the paint job. It's not one of my best. I think the skin tone is maybe a little bit too dark. Um, and I'm not entirely happy with the blonde hair. I've got to say I do struggle with getting realistic blonde hair. Um, the gi though, I'm really happy with the gi. The uh, with highlighting on the uh, on the black gi, I think that came out really well. Um, and it is a good model. It is a good model. It looks just like him. Um, you can't argue. That it doesn't look like him, you, the nose itself gives it away. <laughs> um, you'll probably, if you've seen some of our other videos, you'll notice this was the model I actually used to do the how to paint eyes video. Um, if I can remember rightly from that video, it was the last piece I had to do on this. Um, but I just never got around to doing a video for it, so I'm doing it now. There you go. Um, but yeah, I do really like the model. Um, I'm, I'm okay with the paint job. Um, it could be better. I can find spots where it could be better. But the model overall, I think it's really accurate. I think it's, re I think it's a really good model. Um, I do really love the series as well, which is mainly why I did it. But my, uh, my wife does love it, so that's why I did it. I think it was... Um, it was quite a long print. I think it was about, um, I think it was like 100 hours, maybe. It's like four days or so. Um, again, base done in yellow. Not my favourite thing in the world to paint. 
getting consistent yellow, like solid yellow. It takes so many coats, no matter what, what you're priming in. What it's just bane. As soon as you know you've got a lot of yellow to uh, to base, you're like, oh, I'm not looking forward to this. And uh, I, I dread to think how many coats it was. I think it was like six. Um, but you know, it got there in the end. Um, so yeah, this model available on CG Trader. Um, give it a go. It's a nice model. It's a good model. Um, go along the shelf with all my other busts I've done. Um, but keep watching because we've got some other videos coming up soon. We've got a. Uh, I've got another bust coming up, which is Davy Jones from Pirates of the Caribbean, and I love this bust. This one came out perfect. Um, so we've got that coming up. We've got a couple of videos of previous models we've done that you probably haven't seen yet. Um, James is working on something really large at the moment. So you may see a video on that in the next week or so, maybe. Um, and I'm currently working on something that is super detailed, but I've probably got another week and a half's printing on that before that's done. But um, yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you back in the next video. Thanks a lot. Bye.